planner friends welcome back to my channel this is jen with jen happy planning and today i have for you a plan with me between the 21st to the 27th of february and i am using the beautiful um, sticky sheets from create with mandy i am also going to pull from marabou designs as well as colorful boxes and modern meow to a uh, pair mandy stickers they are from the bloom set and i have decided that it would go well with uh, this uh, white washi tape from the washi tape shop i am placing this on my um sidebar for the week um, normally i use it for um, whatever it is that i feel like on that week sometimes it's uh, chores for the week sometimes it's um, just some encouragement quotes or um, things that come up um, that i fancy uh, remembering and this week i am not really using that sidebar so i am going to you will see in a minute i am going to place offset some of the stickers so it will bleed into the sidebar and i'm going through here um, trying to pair or make little uh, clusters with the colors uh, i found that the colorful boxes as well as the other boxes from marabou and modern meow had similar colors to um, uh, the flower arrangements from uh, um, create with Mandy as well as the circles with the daisies and um, the peace sign so or symbol in this case um, I would have used just these um, boxes from uh, create with Mandy but I find that I always want to sometimes well most of the time um, say things into the boxes rather than the paper uh, of the of the sheet obviously uh, but sometimes i do um, so it's just a matter of um, having several bo boxes around and actually this is my first spread where i have put down so many boxes um, as i recall but i will have to actually do a video of my previous spreads but I'm pretty sure that I haven't. So what I'm doing here is um, whiten out the areas where the color will pop through the white area of the overlaid box. And when I am uh, happy with it, I will just place it down. I'm just making sure that it is straight. Sometimes it's not. Um, sometimes it's just the how I place them. Uh, that there might be a little bit of squint. Um, in there but um, I'm learning how to live with it uh, it's not it's not often easy um, your eye always goes to that area where it doesn't line up and uh, you sort of want to fiddle with it but anyway I think we have all been through that so I have gathered this uh, square box that has a cutout for the month uh, which comes from the marble design book uh, which is a beautiful book. I love all the colors. Um, it works well for spring and summer as well. Um, uh, I think, to be honest, it's one of my favorite books. Uh, I know I say that a lot about most of the books, but to be honest, this, this book is worth buying a second uh, copy or I only have the big one. So I will probably have... Um, wait a little bit until there is a good um, sale on uh, um, Joanne so I can get if they do uh, still um, have in stock the other sizes um, I'm pretty sure there is one size for the uh, for the classic and here I am uh, getting rid of those bubbles that sometimes appear when you have to lift uh, a sticker and when I'm not sure of a placement, I'll just put it ever so uh, lightly onto the paper, as you can see here in the shadow. And then I can see whether I want to place this other one and whether it's a good, yeah, 
that I'm happy with that. I will come back and put more boxes around. As I mentioned earlier, it, this is going to be a box galore um, spread. And I love um, how um, this actually have turned out. Um, I was very busy this week. Um, a lot of things to be catching up in the house and the garden. And I did not have time to upload this uh, video early enough so you're going to see it on Sunday and um, when I'm uploading this to YouTube and I absolutely love 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 um, the after the pen now I have been very uh, not lazy but I haven't done an after the pen spread on my uh, Instagram account but this I will and I will include probably from January. I will do a video um, for my after the pen spreads for January and then February here on YouTube. And I will be posting every so often the um, after the pen spreads in, on Instagram and you will be able to see them um, over there and comment if you wish. Um, because um, it's nice as well to see how they come uh, together at the end. Um, the spread is just not a spread uh, from the point of being decorated, but when they are filled in, if they are filled in, there are sometimes things that happen that keep us from our planners, and that is okay. That is very valid, so um, nobody should be uh, worrying about that. Over here, instead of um, using the whiteout, I'm just using the um, Uniball Signal uh, in white, which is my favorite. It's very creamy, as I've mentioned a um, hundred times before. Um, sometimes I do use the Jelly Roll, but my favorite is the Uniball Signal. And here I'm overlaying, I like in the uh, first um, or, or left page, the to-do uh, sticker from Monday onto um, a thin sticker from the Colorful Boxes, a sticker book from the Happy Planner, um, which is, at the moment is mainly, after this spread, is mainly gold and probably 95% of of all the silver ones, um, which I barely use. So I will be coming up with some ideas to how to use these stickers to really give them use. If I find that I do not use these stickers, I will probably give them away because they're just there sitting and not doing anything really. And over here, I decided to I uh, use the... Um, a cat accent because I'm a cat lover as you know and um, Sundays we tend to um, do very little and we just um, snuggle and stay most of the day if it's not sunny today is sunny so we we are between the garden the terrace and the sitting room because it's there is still a chill in the air so the cats always follow us everywhere. So um, it's Sunday is um, it's just family. It's just us. Well, it's just the two of us plus the cats. So we're four. Um, but that's our little nuclei. And um, here I um, feel that I could do with a few more boxes. So I'm pulling some of the light blues that I still have. Um, probably one or two left now after this spread. I love the colors. I really love the colors, how they came together here from uh, all these, well, three uh, Happy Planner books and um, the Create with Mandy um, bloom set, which I adore. Um, I have to say, uh, Mandy makes beautiful stickers, especially um, for this time of year. The colors are just so yummy. Um, very creamy, but at the same time, I know it's, it's weird to say creamy when it's talking about colors, especially on a 2D, um, 
object but they do look lovely together so I'm going to place a lot of the dots around and I will still have some left. Um, you think that when you see these sheets that, oh no, I'm not going to have enough. You will have more than enough. And here I am uh, pulling as many of the blues that I have. Also the uh, purples because there is quite a bit of color um, in there. There are yellows. Uh, purples, lavenders, blues, oranges, uh, blush color. It's it's just uh, yellow and green. A yellow I mentioned twice, three times already. And then I will use a couple of the dot, dots from the as in the checklist um, or bullet points um, to place here and there, just to um, make those empty spaces have something. I will normally use this for one or two reminders or something like the weather. Um, if it's at the top, I like um, uh, registering or recording the weather um, every day. Today was nine degrees, but uh, it felt like five if you were outside. But full sunshine, very few clouds. Um, yesterday was 8 degrees, but the sun was so beautifully warm. There was no wind and no clouds, so it felt a lot warmer than today. So I like always to record that because it's very easy to uh, forget. And then we're always complaining about the weather and how terrible this summer was and how terrible this winter is and... Uh, what not. So this way, it's a nice way for me to um, to remember, to, to come back to my planner, as I always do, and um, see what happens. So here I am placing the last few um, details um, for um, here and there in between. Um, I will be lifting things and uh, putting them down again if I think it's not going to be right but I settle for this area for my um, these daisies these two daisies um, which are very uh, elongated I would say um, the stem is quite long so that is um, very appropriate for um, a long box on the sides so here I'm thinking what else I can pull from and for Sunday, because I always like to, as I said, I have, if you, if you see here on the 24th, I have a box at the end, a box on the 25th, a bullet point on the 26th and then the 27th has also a box. They tend to be for um, uh, dinners. And here I am using the freebies, which... I have to say, I am probably the only one that I know of. I haven't got a clue how many people do it, but I use um, the freebies. Some people collect the freebies. I am afraid I use them. <laughs> so here I am finishing off. Uh, I've put my sheets onto my planner and I'm finishing up, sorry, finishing up with uh, according to Ali, Spotty Dotty, which is my favorite. Um, well, it's, I have three or four favorites, um, but this Spotty Dotty, um, I adore. It's in gold. It's quite a loud gold, as I um, call it sometimes. It's delicious. I love it. And it brings, um, because the cat, the circle uh, sticker of the cat there does have a little bit of gold as well as the sticker just above it which is also a blush color so this ties in uh, very well and here is the end so i'll take this opportunity to thank you so much for watching i hope you like this video if you did please give me a thumbs up and if you would like to see any more of my future videos please consider subscribing and i will be seeing you on my next video Take very good care of yourselves and happy planning. Bye.